Hey guys, welcome back to part two of the February, or was it March, uh, yeah, it's March 2016 new stuff. <sighs> and I'm here with, uh, Space Road, the two-lap version by Maxi Lucy 77 a remake of K-Hacker's original. And it's far better on how it plays, on how it, and how it looks. The how it plays is especially better. Because how it looks, it's expected to look better. How it plays... <clears throat> ...is not really as expected. Just a little better, just not m nearly as... How it looks because a new thing should because a new remade version of something should always look better than the older version if it doesn't then it fails to be a remake not only that the remake should sometimes bring something new to it It just depends on how what it is like uh like for films generally remakes are not the greatest although there are some that are even better than the originals Anyways, I just think this remake's far better than the original. <clears throat> the two lap version of this track's already even better. Because this track is incredibly long. Like a small speed modifier would actually make it much more interesting. Maybe by a bit faster, like 10% faster. Don't want to go too fast. And on top of that, it looks great. On to the next track, which is a uh, nightlife party by We Luigi. Okay, let's see. Blue shell. Nope. Fuck blue shells. Fantastic. Again, same problem as Yoshi's Magic Yarn Basket and a lot of other tracks I've played. There's just a lot of whiteness in the textures. Or at least the uh, vertices. It would be nice if it were a little shaded. I do like the confetti uh, acting as uh, basically the, the leaves platform. And the use of the wine, or the shot glasses, as a... Uh, as props. In some cases, 
the ones that drop have the thing. Oh yes, the puddle. Like right here. Shit. Yay. Not bad of a track, just needs less white shades in it. Make it a bit darker looking. Who's a double dipper? Oh, I almost hit that. Well, this track's actually not too bad. Anyways, on to the next one with uh, Castle Circuit by Legend of 82.41.998. God, there's a lot of numbers in his name. And the crowd goes wild over this race. An entirely pointless cannon. Okay. Track's a little simple. Neep. Number one, not you. Oh, ho, 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 ho. On to a uh, tropical factory by Snicky. For some reason, it makes me think of the uh, the Southeast Pacific Islands, like uh, the one with, I think it's Borneo or something with the uh, or Sumatra with. With those factories. Not quite sure. Perhaps someone can elaborate on that for me. But I do like this track. Like, uh... From the looks of it. 
Let's just hope the hairpin turns are not like annoying as fuck. Able to get the chain chomp to work. Nice. Oh my god. These are some interesting boost panels, at least the animation and the textures used. Okay. Oh my god, this is awesome. Mm -mm. Whoa. I'm also glad it's two laps as well. The creator put in quite a lot of effort for this. Whoa. That forklift came close to hitting me. Whoa! Ow. Fuck. Nice track. Really, really nice track. And let's see how the other two will compare. Next up, we've got Big Nature City by IGMB. Let me see. Right here. Whoa. Uh, it looks a little over the play. All over the place. Nice TVs. That's nice. Oh, 
Dog churd. <laughs> Me. I actually wouldn't mind exploring this uh, track. Fuck you. I live dangerously. Love to do it. What? Suddenly night. What? Just the wall suddenly appearing. Whoa. <laughs> this is awesome. The everyday life of Mario Kart. You're welcome. Hey look, it's early morning or dawn. <laughs> Ow. Fuck, how's that an off road? Or did I just accidentally let go of the A button at the worst time? Second worst. We're taking the back road to, uh... This part. Oh shit! No! Fuck. Mm. There we go. This is a nice track. <clears throat> Fairly nice track. Let's see. On to the next one. Pure Mid Desert by Legend of 8241998, aka <clears throat> the guy who made Castle Circuit. Oh, I think, yeah, I put it on here. Because Pyramid Desert sounds like such a redundant name to me. I mean, most pyramids are in the desert. Although there are some in the forest, rainforest as well, with the Aztecs. Mm. But the pyramid desert we know of is called the Sahara. Again, it's really, really white. If there was a lot more shading done with the, anything that wasn't the sand in particular, it would be nice. It's just being a... It's just that these kinds of white-looking uh, uh, vertices are a real pet peeve of mine. 
Uh oh. At least the uh, the road's thick enough to make those kinds of turns. Otherwise, I'd be really pissed off. I don't know. I just feel like putting goats on the, this track now. Ow. I got myself! Ow. Oh! Ow. Oh my god. Anyways, uh, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I shall see you guys in the next one.